Hey, I'm Seth with Land the House. This is a ram pump. It's a water pump that requires no fuel or electricity to operate, only flowing, falling water. So in this case, I've got seven foot of drop, known as head pressure, coming into the pump. And there is a waste valve right here. When I push this, it will begin to cycle. And it builds pressure here in this pressure tank. Now I have the delivery pipe closed off and so it's just building pressure over and over again and not pushing any water uphill. So the ram pump will build pressure until it reaches the maximum potential of this drop here. In my case, 70 PSI, which is pretty strong. Last summer, I put various fill material in this tank to see what would happen. Inner tube, racquetballs, tennis balls, water bottle, and even a foam pool noodle. The pressure in here with the delivery valve closed is enough to crush most of these things. So it was suggested over and over again that I should see what happens when I put eggs inside of the pressure tank. So let me show you what happens when I release 70 PSI here. When I open this valve, yeah, you can see a lot of pressure. So let's go ahead and open up this pressure tank and put eggs in here and see what happens. I haven't done this yet, so this test might be either incredibly exciting or a total bust. And let's go ahead and unscrew this and put the eggs in here. I've got a union here on this tank to make it easy to access the inside. Let's see if we can go ahead and do that here. Let's start off by just putting one egg in here. Now, because eggs sink in fresh water, let's put a couple of these tennis balls in here just to make sure it stays up enough so we can see it. I'm gonna screw this back here on the ram pump. There's our egg sitting on top of those tennis balls. I'm gonna go ahead and turn this valve on here. That will bring the water to the system. Turn this on. Okay, hopefully it doesn't go out of sight here. If it does, we'll put some tennis balls up top so it keeps it in place. <laughs> Nothing yet. There's one tennis ball going. Another one's imploding there. The ram pump has now reached max pressure, which from my testing before shows about 70 to 72 PSI. And the egg has not had any change whatsoever. So I'm guessing that 70 PSI is not enough to crack that egg. You can see the ram pump pressure tank, I mean the drive pipe here is uh, hitting hard. And you can hear it vibrate all the way up the hill. And that means that it has reached max pressure, but nothing happening to our egg down here. I was hoping for something more dramatic, but kind of anticipating that it would be anticlimactic. So we know that 70 PSI is not enough to crush an egg. Anyway, thank you so much for watching this fun but uneventful test. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.